So tell me exactly why you're here. Um, I'm here to get my um, Adam's apple decreased in size so I have a more appearance of a woman. I want you to see exactly what it is that I can remove and what I can't remove. This is the area that bothers me. Mm-hmm. Um, it pokes out. So I can remove this part and this part. You're going to have a one-inch incision here. And it takes about 30 minutes to do this. And now we're going to just make that incision, and then we separate the muscle down to where the cartilage is. Here's the bottom of the cartilage right there. All I'm doing now is just outlining the piece of cartilage I'm about to remove, because that's coming off and just taking off the cartilage in one piece, that's all. We've totally closed the two sides of the muscle, so there's no hole there anymore. Now we're going to close the skin. Last piece of tape. So the surgery went great. Pretty easy, huh? Join us is Dr. Toby Mayer, co-director of the Beverly Hills Institute of Aesthetic and Reconstructive Surgery, along with his patient, April. Welcome to you both. Welcome. Thank you. Welcome, April. And we were just talking about this, and, and, and it is a curiosity. Less common to have that prominent Adam's apple in women, but do you have a lot of women coming in because they're concerned about it? We've been doing this for about 35 years, and we do about 50 men a year, but uh, patients like April, we only do 6 to 12 a year, and usually for the same problem. The Adam's apple sticks out like the prow of a ship. And, and women will say, why, why me? You exactly. Know, why, why is my Adam's apple so prominent? And it's just genetics. Exactly. It's so great all. to be up here. I've known him 34 years. He was my professor at USC. Long How was he? Yeah. Back in the day. <laughs> sir, was he a uh, I mean, No, no, he was excellent. Don't change. Yeah. Right? But he and you saw Dr. Mayer's surgery just like we did on on the uh -huh. example that horizontal incision. Sure. And you have to know it's all about knowing the anatomy, correct? Right. Move those strap muscles, and according to what April wanted, removed the amount of the right amount of cartilage. Right. April's a little different. Very often we'll see uh, actresses that'll come in, and they will have just the prow of the ship sticking out. She had not only the prow of the ship, but the rest of her larynx being a little larger than normal. Now let's show everyone the, the result here because it really is. It looks and just a couple days, right? And she's swollen now, but that'll go down over the next few weeks. And wow. And April, you're happy? I'm very happy. So if you're happy, then we're all happy. That is fantastic happy work. Thank you so much, Dr. Mayer. You're welcome. Nice job. I appreciate you being here. Coming up.